What's up, YouTube? The name is Anna, and as you already read by the title, hold on, hold on, hold on, before we get into all that, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications so you can get notified every time I post a video. And with that being said, let's get into the video. already read by the title which today what we are going to be doing is a Shein phone case haul so I'm about to show y'all my package and basically all the phone cases and I'm going to be trying them on my phone so yeah and that brings me to say this in my later on videos the quality will be better because this is not going to be the camera that I'm going to be recording on so yeah so this is my Shein package or whatever. And I ordered like 15, 14, either like 14 through 16. It might be 15, I think. But, yeah. And so y'all know. So y'all know. I got an iPhone 8, and this is the case that it came with. Not, it didn't come with the case. This is the case that I bought. It's the, I guess you could say, white one. Made up. But yeah. So I got all these cases. I'm going to show y'all my um, favorite, least, like, most favorite to least favorite. Okay, y'all, so I'm back. And the first case I'm going to start with is this one. It's a pink case. And I was actually going to order way more than this. But I was going back through them and I was going through the reviews and some of them was like saying like bad stuff about the cases and I was like I'm not going to take my chance. So this is the case. It's clear as y'all can see. This what it looks like. This what it looks like from the front and the back. You can see the um both the little things because it's clear obviously. This is what the side looks like. And it got a little hope in it. Like, ordering them. Like, I'm going to put the little picture probably over here somewhere for y'all can go order if y'all like it. This one right here, you can't get it anymore. Because it said it's not, the product is not available anymore. It's like an avocado with a tan on the butt or whatever. So yeah, this one is like hard, so it seemed like it will protect your phone good. This is what it looks like. It's not focusing on good, but yeah. So I'm going to put this back. This is the next case. It's black, and it got, like, this little dragon thing on it. And this, this seemed like it would protect your phone, like the avocado one. So, yeah, it got the little black things for the sound button and the power button. And then, like, it's real good for your phone. Like, all you do have to do is make sure you got the right size for your phone. For some of the cases... If you got an SE2020, you can get it. This is a clear case. You can't really see the letters of the iPhone. Like, it say iPhone down here somewhere. But you can see this Apple sign. And, yeah. And this is what it looks like from the front. Next, I think this is going to be one of my favorite cases. Like, either one or two. Because, like, it's... Oh, like it's a 3D case. Just say boys tears. I'm pretty sure I seen this before somewhere. 
This seems like if you drop your phone, it'll like pop out. But I don't know. So if you flip it, it should be like that. Uh, this right here is all the the silent mode. It's all the way in there. These work pretty good, I think. I don't, yeah, they work good. And so this is the power button, and yeah, to put one of my favorite cases because look at this thing. So yeah, this case is one of the cases that had bad reviews, but I was like, I'm just going to take my chances on it and see what it is. So, Also, another disclaimer, all these cases are less than $4.50 without tax added. So, yeah. It got like, hold on, let me take the little phone out. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. Look, it look a little bit. Y'all see that? Something's wrong with it. This is what they were saying on it, and they were saying like these little bears was like all mixed place and stuff. I was going to get this one gummy bear case, but it had some bad reviews on it, so I didn't get it. And this is probably another one of my favorite cases besides this, but nobody's actually going to see that. And if you look closely, though, it's like something wrong with that right there. But it, it don't bother me real, real bad anyways. Yeah. It's not going in. There we go. You got one of these little things right here that can't even see it though. Let me turn the brightness down. One of these. That covers the little charger hole, but here is it on the phone. It covers up the Apple Sun and the little iPhone thing. I think this actually will bother me. I'm gonna write a review about this one more definitely because what? Look at the blue bear. Like, it's something right there. I probably can't see, but it's like details that messed up around the blue bear. Like it was handmade instead of like machinely made and stuff like that. So, yeah, but I ain't tripping, tripping about it. It's cute. It's 3D. These are not soft. These are hard. Um, The buttons work good. You can easily get to the little thing right there. That's the camera. Uh. Or you hold it or whatever. Yeah. We kind of got a lot of more cases to go. But hopefully, this editing goes well with me putting the little pictures. If y'all want to buy them myself. And yeah, this one. I actually like this one too because it's clear. And part of the main reason why I got a whole bunch of clear cases is because I got a white phone. Or a glass phone, whatever you want to call it. But another reason why I don't like clear cases was because, like, this kind of clear is because they, like, tend to turn yellowish after so long. But you can see the iPhone and the Apple sign. And some of the cases on Shea actually got like Android, like Samsung, and um, I don't know the other phones, but I think they got some LGs on there and some Samsung, but yeah, mostly iPhone. But if you want, you can go check out that. You can kind of feel the print of the little details, but that's. The buttons work good. The 
I'm gonna show, I'm gonna uh, try to put the prices and stuff like on there where I can go get them. Because some of these cases are actually cute or whatever, but here we go, that one. Well, all of them is cute. I mean, if they was ugly, I wouldn't have got them. So, yeah. This has blue detailing on it, blue butterflies, and pink and orange and purple kind of clear but it's like I don't know how to explain it but it's a hardback case it's not a flimsy case I don't think none of these cases is flimsy except that avocado one but this is a long power button excuse me if you ever had an iPhone 8 7 I think is the thing and the SE 2020 then you know that this is not actually that long but you can easily get to the silent mode button and that's what it looks like on your phone pretty cute and that's what it looks like if you're doing like a little picture yeah the next case I don't think I'm gonna like this one if y'all see what they look like when the website versus what they look like on this camera it's kind of different but let me just show you. this is this case and let's open it and see I think, oh it's kind of similar people are saying this move easily but it really doesn't here we go my uh screen protector already got cracks in it so yeah, this case, I'm going to turn it, I'm going to uh, take it back out to show y'all if it's flimsy or not, but you can see the Apple sign a little bit, the, app, the iPhone words, and this is like kind of hard to push over. And if you was taking a picture... And I think that this will um, pop out, like if you push it too hard or like it could easily, I can't see, it will easily come out, like you could take it out, probably put it back in, but it won't be the same. If y'all get what I'm saying, like it's not really... A good quality case. It seems like it's cheap, which it is. You get what you pay for, but yeah, this is not really that flimsy, and that is good. Now moving on to the next case. This might be one of my favorite cases. And let's see what it looks like. So this is what it looks like. Let's take this out. I can see on the website. Oh, let's see what it looks like on the phone. It's actually clear. So that means over time it's going to get yellowish. It's nice, nice, nice. That's what it looks like. I turned my brightness down so y'all can see. Easy access to silent mode. Also, guys, this case is like flimsy, like, but since this is right here, it got kind of a hard back. So, next case is this one. Y'all will see what it looks like in a picture, probably most definitely because if this is not what I see in the picture. When I was watching a review, some people were saying the holographic comes out, and it does. But I want my holographic to stay in there. So, yeah, I'm going to show y'all what it looks like without the holographic. Ugly and plain. I don't like that. And that's what it looks like. So, I'm going to keep it out right quick to show y'all what it looks like. Both ways. If y'all like it, y'all like it. Y'all don't. You 
this is like this is where the power button is so you could i'm gonna click the top one and this is the up and down button like volume up and down button and then this is that and it's easy access to the silent mode i think it's a little bit deep in there covers up the apple sign i could kind of see it a little bit at the top and this I can see the icon a little bit just a little bit now putting the holographic back in the best way to me and that's what it looks like no iPhone the logo or no logo or the name thin slip of um, holographic and yeah and I think I'm gonna actually wear this case because it's real cute. And the reason I got this is because all iPhones is like roundish. So I needed a, if y'all can tell, hard little Lego thing. I mean, ledge. If y'all can see. And yeah, let's get on to the next case. One of these cases I'm actually not gonna try on because it's like a regular clear case so I'm not probably this one. This is a regular clear case. The one that I'm not gonna try on is flimsy and yeah and I got two clear cases because one of them this one I'm gonna put a pop socket on. This is the regular I'm gonna put a pop socket on this one and then this one, I'm not putting a pop socket on. This is going to be a regular clear sparkly case. And I'm about to show y'all what it looks like on my phone. Very cute. That's why I got it. Easy access to the silent mode. And yeah, in this case, it's flimsy. It's Feels like it will protect your phone, but then again, it's like mm, flimsy. This is the next case. I don't know if I recorded this or not, but this is the next case. This is what it looks like on my phone. Giving me very much iPhone 11 vibes. You can see the name and logo. Easy access to the um, silent mode. And yeah. Doesn't protect your phone because it's like real flimsy. But um, if I got the styrofoam, make sure I keep it in there because if not, your possibly your your um phone case can get messed up even more. I got another yellow case and I only got two more, so yeah. This is the money case. Let me come back a little bit. We got the full potential of this case right here. So I know it's dark. I turned the brightness down. But yeah. Just to show y'all what the case really looks like. Because it's yellow. Giving me mustard. A little bit vibes on the camera. But it's not a mustard color. This is one of those flimsy cases. But it's, um, what's the name? It's matte. It's matte like. Flimsy, flimsy. Yeah. It's like the avocado, avocado case. This is the last case. This is like the other purple one. Butterfly case with the little purple. I mean the blue buttons. But this is a lime green. Bright yellow. Whatever. So it has stopped recording or whatever. But yeah. This is the case. Can see a little bit, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit. Easy access to the silent mode that keeps turning on. And yeah, this case is like the butterfly one. Basically, 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 basically. It's not flimsy. Not flimsy. Don't play with this case. It's not flimsy. 
Okay, y'all, so I'm going to end this video off with my favorite case of them all. And that's the holographic one. The second one up is the um, voice tears on. That one again. That's that one. And the third one, the last one that's my favorite is... Probably the avocado one. And yeah. So thanks for watching this video, my first YouTube video published. And yeah, so if y'all like this video or y'all like my vibe or whatever, make sure y'all subscribe and stay tuned for more videos to come. I already know my next video, so yeah, make sure you stay tuned to know my next video. And yeah, make sure y'all follow all my social medias, period. And yeah, give this video a thumbs up. It ain't gonna kill you. Make sure y'all, if y'all know some ideas y'all wanna see, comment down below. And yeah.